Top Ongoing and Completed Projects in Namibia In this video, we will take a look at ongoing and completed projects in Namibia. These projects have had a major impact on the country's economy and infrastructure, and they have helped to improve the lives of Namibians. But before we start, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I will be uploading new videos about Africa every week, and I would love for you to join me on this journey. Number 12. The Walvis Bay Port Expansion The Walvis Bay Port Expansion project aims to increase the port's capacity in Walvis Bay, Namibia. The project cost $1.5 billion and was finished in 2021. The port can now handle more cargo thanks to the expansion. 10 million tons of cargo can now be handled annually by the expanded port. The expansion is anticipated to strengthen Namibia's economy and generate 10,000 new jobs. Number 11. The trans Nineveh Railway Rehabilitation A project to repair the trans Nineveh Railway in Namibia is called the trans Nineveh Railway Rehabilitation. The project cost $2 billion and was finished in 2022. The infrastructure of the railway has been strengthened, increasing its efficiency. More passengers and cargo can now be carried on the restored railway. The rehabilitation is anticipated to increase the economy of Namibia and generate 5,000 jobs. Number 10. The Windhoek International Airport Expansion The Windhoek International Airport Expansion is a project to expand the Windhoek International Airport in Namibia. The project is expected to be completed in 2024 at a cost of $2.5 billion. The expansion will increase the airport's capacity to handle more passengers and cargo. The expanded airport will be able to handle 5 million passengers per year. The expansion is expected to create 10,000 jobs and boost the economy of Namibia. Number 9. The Karibib Solar Power Plant A solar power plant in Namibia is called the Karibib Solar Power Plant. The plant cost $500 million and was finished in 2023. The plant can produce 50 megawatts of power, which is enough to power 50,000 homes. The facility is anticipated to decrease Namibia's reliance on imported fossil fuels and generate $100 million in annual savings for the nation. Number 8. The Group Fontaine Water Treatment Plant In Group Fontaine, Namibia, there is a water treatment facility called the Group Fontaine Water Treatment Plant. The plant cost $100 million and was finished in 2022. Water is supplied by the plant, which has a daily capacity of 100,000 cubic meters, to the city of Grootfontein and the surrounding area. The plant will give the residents of Grootfontein and the surrounding area access to clean water, which is expected to improve their quality of life. The plant is also anticipated to strengthen the local economy by luring in new businesses and industries. Number 7. The Katima Mulilo Bridge in Katima Mulelo, Namibia, there is a bridge called the Katima Mulelo Bridge that spans the Zambezi River. The bridge costs $200 million. The bridge connects Namibia and Zambia and has aided in boosting both trade and tourism in the area. The bridge has facilitated the movement of people and goods between the two nations, which has boosted both nations' economies. Additionally, the bridge has made it simpler for visitors to the area, which has boosted the local tourism industry. Number 6. The Rundu International Airport Expansion The Rundu International Airport Expansion is a project to expand the Rundu International Airport in Namibia. The project is expected to be completed in 2025 at a cost of $1 billion. The expansion will increase the airport's capacity to handle more passengers and cargo. The expanded airport will be able to handle 1 million passengers per year. The expansion is expected to create 10,000 jobs and boost the economy of Namibia. The expansion will make it easier for people to travel to and from Rundu, which will help to boost the economy of the region. Number 5. The Okahanja Water Treatment Plant The Okahanja Water Treatment Plant is a water treatment plant in Okahanja, Namibia. The plant has a capacity of 50,000 cubic meters per day and it provides water to the city of Okahanja and the surrounding area. The plant is expected to improve the quality of life for the people of Okahanja and the surrounding area by providing them with access to clean water. The plant is also expected to boost the economy of the region by attracting new businesses and industries. Number 4. The Etosha National Park Water Management Project The goal of the Etosha National Park Water Management Project is to increase the park's water supply. The project cost $150 million and was finished in 2022. The project increased the water supply to the park by 50%, 
which contributed to the improvement of the park's wildlife's health. Additionally, the project has made it simpler for visitors to the park, which has boosted the tourism sector. The project involved the construction of a new dam, the rehabilitation of existing dams, and the installation of a water distribution system. The project has also helped to improve the management of the park's water resources. The project has been a success, and it has had a positive impact on the park's wildlife and the tourism industry. The project has also helped to improve the management of the park's water resources. Number 3. The Swicotman Dunes Rehabilitation Project The Swicotman Dunes Rehabilitation Project was completed in 2023 at a cost of $100 million. It has planted over 1 million trees in the dunes, stabilizing them and making them more attractive to tourists. The project involved the planting of trees, the construction of fences, and the removal of invasive species. It has been a success, stabilizing the dunes and making them more attractive to tourists. Number 2. The Okahanja Ajuwarongo Road Upgrade. The project to upgrade the road between Okahanja and Ajuwarongo is known as the Okahanja Ajuwarongo Road Upgrade. The upgrade has increased road safety and facilitated travel between the two cities for residents. Through the recruitment of new businesses and industries, the upgrade is anticipated to strengthen the local economy. In this project, the road was widened, new bridges were built, and new safety equipment was installed. The road is now safer and easier to travel on thanks to the project's success. The project is anticipated to strengthen the local economy by drawing in new businesses and industries. Number 1. The Windhoek Okahanja Expressway The Windhoek Okahanja Expressway project aims to construct an expressway between Okahanja and Windhoek. The $1 billion project is anticipated to be finished in 2026. The expressway will cut the distance between the two cities' travel time in half, from 1 hour to 30 minutes. The expressway is anticipated to strengthen the local economy by luring in new businesses and industries. The project is currently underway, and it is expected to be completed in 2026. The expressway will be a four-lane, divided highway with a speed limit of 120 km per hour. The expressway is expected to boost the economy of the region by attracting new businesses and industries. These are just a few of the many completed projects that have had a major impact on Namibia. These projects have helped to improve the country's economy, infrastructure, and quality of life. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below.